put the hounds out before the rain again. Been carnage in New Zealand. A little bit further north, they got pretty severe flooding. Further north from that, they've got a little bit of flooding, but they're expecting shocking weather over the next day or two. They're expecting a lot more flooding. We, thankfully, have only had not much more than surface flooding. And we're not expected to get that big deluge that they're going to get up north. I'm hoping that we're going to be okay. I've got work tonight. I'm guessing there'll be a lot of people without power that are going to need assistance. That'll no doubt keep us busy. Pretty sure Angus will be posted up by the fire. So that's the main thing. What do you think, Millie? Are you going to be all snuggled up under a blanket? Millie doesn't really like swimming. Flooding is definitely not her cup of tea. Looks like it gets a bit too boggy down the bottom there for us. I don't much feel like bathing these dogs, so we're going to turn around here. It goes for miles. It's quite a nice little track. What do you see, Angus? Any balls that need rescuing? Right, come on, we're turning around. Come on. Angus is thinking about going for a swim. Prefer it if he chooses not to. Where's Millie? What's he doing, Millie? Come on. Good girl. Nice Pretty windy. Be all kinds of smells being carried to the hounds. I guarantee they're enjoying that. most of the country battening down the hatches. I think we've done pretty well to get out and about in time to beat the rain. When it sets in, it's meant to be for a couple of days. Millie, come on. Come on. So we're just and only just going to miss the rain again. And the hounds are running for the car. Lest they get wet. Right, come on you two. Dinner time. You hungry Angus? You hungry? Come on then, let's go. 